What up you guys? I'm back with another video. Today's video is going to be a small vlog, you guys. A very short vlog update on uh, my life, like I always do. But right now, I'm currently putting up this shelf. As you can see, behind me, I am organizing my altar, as you can see in the background, because there's going to be more things that I need to add on. Uh, if you guys are interested on um, talking about my religion and the whole entire like santeria and everything let me know in the comments down below i will talk about it and you guys can ask some questions and i will answer them through a video right now i am going to put my beautiful lovely santisima muerte on this shelf right here because i need to add more stuff here on my thing so that's what i'm gonna do but once it's done, I'm gonna show y'all guys. I'm gonna show you guys. Before we even get started with this video, what I need y'all to do is hit that subscribe button, like this video, and hit that bell to be notified when I post new videos. You guys are having a wonderful morning, evening, afternoon, night, whatever, whenever you watch this. If you don't know who I am, I am Nando. Welcome to the day in my life. You new to the channel, welcome to the gang, welcome to the family. Welcome, welcome, and before, Last but not least, I just want to tell you guys, thank you guys for letting me hit 500. Thank you. We're going to keep working our way up to 1,000. That's the next, the next goal. So if you know people that know other people that they watch YouTube and they're interested in watching my videos, tell them to subscribe. Share with everyone. Share it, share it, share it. So right now, we're about to get into this. Putting the shelf up. So I'm going to show y'all once it's done. Alrighty, you guys. So I am done. Uh, it kind of took me maybe like four or five hours because reason being for some reason This drill bit right here It was giving me a, such a hard time to fit These in these blue things So I had to figure a way to make it fit and I made it fit so that's a plus. But I want to show you guys um, how it came out. So take a look, and then we're going to talk about a few other things. If When I started this vlog, uh, this is actually Vlogmas. Uh, I know it's nothing like Christmassy or exciting, but I'm fixing my room up. As you can tell, I have one shelf there, and I have another shelf in front of me. So I'm going to show you guys. This is my Santissima Muerte, if you guys know. If you guys don't know who she is, she is known as the Grim Reaper. She's known in Mexico. She's not bad, she's good. So just let everybody know, she's good. Can you work bad things with her? That's on you, but you will regret it. So I advise you not. Um, she does make things happen. If you pray to her and you honor her and you ask her for um, whatever you want. So basically she is like the God's helper. You know, like whatever you ask for, she'll help you. You know, it's just like praying. All right, you guys. I know some of you guys getting confused. Like, you know, you shouldn't be praying to anything else but God. I, you know, I totally understand. But in reality, all the stuff that we're praying to and all the stuff that, you know, people say that it's not good or whatever. I was raised in it. So if you guys know what Santeria is, look it up. If you want me to explain more about it, I will in a future video but I just want to tell you guys that um, if you want I'll tell you more information about her I'm not gonna sit here and explain it all but I just want to tell you guys that I want to give a few updates <laughs> before I end this video uh, before I end the video I want to play a clip where I have me jalapeno peppers with bacon and cream cheese so I'm gonna play that right now what's up you guys I'm back with another video Today's video is gonna be how to do a jalapeno stuffed pepper. So basically, it's gonna be stuffed with cream cheese, some sprinkled like shredded cheese that you mix inside the cream cheese, and some bacon. So we got, I got the garlic, um, the garlic cream cheese, and I got me some thick sliced bacon. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna clean these and then I'm gonna cut them straight down and then I'm gonna show y'all the rest what I do. 
So this is how you cut it and basically you're gonna get the middle which is this part out and then I put it in there so I'm doing that one. I'm gonna show y'all so what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut like that and on the other side you're gonna cut and then it should come right off. And then you're gonna cut these little things. Make sure when you guys, when you cut it, make sure there's no seeds and there's none of this. Because if there is, your mouth is gonna be on fire, okay? Also, when you make these, make sure you're wearing gloves and not follow what I do, because it will burn. But you know what, I'm hard-headed and uh, yeah, I don't have gloves. So we just gonna do it like that. And if you don't want no like access, like extra access like this, just take it off. Thing is, take it out. Like if you're gonna make it, make sure you take it out at least 40 minutes. Take out the cream cheese for 40 minutes and the bacon is in the freezer. Take it out like maybe two hours before so it could like cool down and, and it could unravel itself to make sure it gets really soft. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna rinse these out and I'm gonna mix the cream cheese and the cheese, the shredded cheese that I got. So let me show y'all. See that shredded cheese and that's the cream cheese. I'm gonna mix it all in. Then I'm gonna stuff them and wrap the bacon. So I'm gonna show y'all. So I'm mixing it up. You could get yellow cheese, you could get um, cheddar cheese. You could get any kind of cheese and mix it in. And make sure it's like soft. Like you see how I'm going like this? Make sure the cream cheese is real soft, you guys. Because if it's not soft, it is going to be really hard to mix this. Then we're going to do one. So here it goes. I'm going to get some cream cheese. Boom. Spread it out. Voila. You don't need that much cream cheese. Cause when it gets hot, you don't want it to like be melted out from it. So you don't need that much. That's how you do it. Now I'm gonna show you the bacon part. Okay, so we're gonna unravel. <gasps> no, I only got, I only got three pieces of bacon. So we're gonna cut this because I'm trying to have bacon for all of them, not just one. Every piece of them. And mind you, this bacon is long, so you won't have to... This bacon is long, y'all. So, if your bacon is really long, you could probably... You could cut it if you want. That's your choice. But I'm cutting it because I need bacon. Because without the bacon, it ain't good. It's the whole part to put bacon on it. See? Like that. gonna let them sit in the oven for um, 15 minutes no more than that 15 20 minutes I'm put it for 20 20 minutes put it for 20 minutes because the bacon kind of takes a few minutes to like bake and like get crispy so you want the bacon to get crispy so I'll say 20 minutes the most and put it on 400 degrees so take that advice and they're toasting so it's done y'all. This one messed up because I was trying to take it out and it fell on the plate. Yeah, that's how you make it. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it.
All right, so I want to give you guys another update before we literally end this vlog. Tomorrow, I am getting my iPad. My iPad. I'm excited, you guys. So with that being said, I am going to do an unboxing video for you guys on my iPad that I get from my school, which I'm excited. So yeah, and I also want to thank again, you guys. Thank you guys for subscribing to my channel. Welcome new subscribers. Welcome to the family. Welcome to the gang. Let us keep going up. Never stop. We're not looking back. We're gonna keep going because New Year's is right around the corner. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna have we're gonna go through changes. We're gonna change our ways in life starting today. So we're gonna be more positive. We're gonna be more happy. We're not gonna be lazy. Shake it off and tell yourself, you know what? I got this. Whatever it is that you was having difficulties doing, tell your mind that you can do it, and I promise you, you can. I just want to thank you guys like i really can't stop thanking you guys for getting me to 500 thank you next milestone is a thousand i believe it i know we can um there's a few things that i want to do this new year and i'm going to explain to you in the later on in the videos but one of them i'm gonna let you guys know now for one of them one of them is i really want to do merch so with that being said i really need you guys to go subscribe to my channel if you're new to my channel subscribe leave a comment saying you're a new subscriber and i'll welcome you please you guys let's get me to thousand subscribers and i can start selling merch so you guys get me to a thousand i'll start selling merch i'll come out with um certain items that you guys want to get for me for my own logo i'm going to start putting in the works for it i know i'm at 500 but you know what 500 is in the blink of an eye you could go to a thousand i believe it so you guys get me to a thousand and we can start selling merch also this is vlogmas one like i said before uh we're going to start vlogmas i'm going to start doing a few christmas videos i hope you guys are excited because i am I am completely excited. This is my favorite month. I love December. I love Christmas. Uh, I also want you guys to leave a comment down below on what is it that you ask for Christmas. Let me know in the comments below. I just want to say be you, do you, stay you, and I'm out and I'm going to see y'all on another video. Peace.